Good morning. This is Makasia Jackson, the host and the founder of the JFK Report. And this morning, we have met a gentleman who was removed from the FBI January 6th wanted list, number 343, Luke Philip Robinson. I'm here with Kyle Clifton, true American patriot. If it wasn't for him, we wouldn't have got this investigation done with Luke Robinson. Kyle was the same gentleman, same American patriot who helped American Grayson find Ray Epson. So thank you, Kyle Clifton, for being a patriot and doing the deep investigation on you. And we just hope the best for this country. We pray for Luke. We don't know what's going on, but God bless you, Kyle, and thank you. God bless you as well. Luke Robinson was at the Capitol on January 6th. That's him. He had a firearm and an earpiece on him on the 6th. And 10 days, and 10 days after the FBI came to my house for January 6th, I met Luke Robinson on April 3rd, 2021. And when I was arrested on May 18th, 2021, Luke Robinson disappeared. We're here this morning to confront him here in Phoenix, Arizona, and God bless the USA. The person on the back has to be cool. Hey man. What's up? Holy shit. You're just, I'm, I'm making this hill. Hey man, why? Why were we removed from 343 on the FBI wanted list? I don't know. Hold on. Can, can I talk to you after this? Hey, man. Let's talk. Hey, man. We got... Hold, hold on. Can you please wait a second? We, hey, we don't want to do... We just want to know what's going on, man. We can help you out. We want to help you. We need no, to figure no, out what's going no. on. Hold on a second. I'm making an uh, on sale right now. At the... Are you a federal informant? No. no. No? Were you a crisis actor? No, I wasn't. Were you... Did you make a deal with the feds to spy on me because they had a fire on no, you on January 6th. Can you please relax for a second? I mean, he, my, hey man, I mean. We just want to know what's going on because uh, there's a lot of stuff right now with Ray Epps. You know Ray Epps? Do you know him personally? Ray Epps? No. Because we knew we knew you were at the Capitol and we weren't sure if. Uh, you had an earpiece and a firearm, man. That's that's a you had a firearm on federal property. That's serious stuff. I got charged with a misdemeanor for parading a picket, and that's a firearm, man. And they, I met you ten days after the FBI came to my house yeah, on April third. Okay. I mean, what's going on, man? All right, yeah. What's with the earpiece at the Capitol? Where? Who were you talking to? I'll see you guys later. Who were you talking to? You actually want to buy this bike or not? No, thank you. Who were you talking to at the capital of the airpiece? See you guys later. Hey man, we're just trying to figure out what's going on. Luke Robinson, number 343, removed from the FBI wanted list. Ten days after the cap, uh, ten days after the FBI came to my house, I met Luke on April 3rd, 2021. And two weeks ago, I found out Luke Robinson was moved from 343 on the FBI most wanted list. And he seems, he's a nice guy. We just want to know what's going on. He had a firearm on him on federal property and earpiece and he was removed from the Capitol. We don't know what's going on, brother, but we just want to figure it out. If you, hey man, if you're in serious stuff, you got to get a lawyer, you need to figure it out, man. This is, uh, we want you to be safe. I know who you are. You're, are you cooperating with the FBI? I, I just don't really want to talk. Why'd they remove you from the list? Good. They've only removed three names. Go on what? They've only removed three names from the FBI list. We don't. We, we're not sure why they removed you. Why they removed Ray Epps? We just. We're praying for you, Luke. We're praying for you. Amen. Everyone, that's Luke Robinson, alleged federal informant, driving off from our operation. We tried to interrogate him, asking questions about being an alleged federal informant. He was removed from the FBI's most wanted list as number 343. Ray Epps was also removed. Ray Epps was number six, uh, number 16, removed from the most wanted list. We just have these questions for America.